Lena, welcome. Hello, hi. You know how we open this. I ask you what is the innovation you're here to talk yes. about. And yes. Just quickly tell us the results so far of what you're doing with Ellen China. When we talk about innovation, we talk about, we think about not only about extension of contents, we talk about, we think about the values we can bring to our readers, our users, and our partners and advertisers. So we always think about what kind of new values we can find inside it. Yeah. Okay. Thank Over you. to you, Lena. Great, thank you. Hello, hi everybody. Very nice to have you here. <laughs> and my colleagues there. <laughs> okay. Um, it, it, um, I have been asked to talk about innovation in China and uh, not only sharing about the media. Today, I think we have the whole day to talk about our duties as publishers, how we work on content creative, how we work on this afternoon. We talk about how we think about the technology innovation how we try to extend all our content distribution to different channels to be always innovative following what is happening now. But at the same time, when we think about big brand, we think about what kind of values today we can create besides the content or on top of contents. Um, still, I want to go back about the story of China because it, it is a very exciting country. When we think about 1988, you have already the fashion weeks everywhere around the world. China is this image. You saw on it. And it's all about, fashion is all about education, 1988. But when we think about 20 years later, when we approach 2010, 2012, it's already become a huge um, information, large reaches um, media or society. We look at L by 2012, L have become turned from monthly to uh, semi-monthly, means two times per month. L has already more than 200 million page view on website. We launch already on pad, on mobile, etc. So it is already a digital age and it is a large rich magazine and titles in terms of advertising uh, market share we have more than 22% of market share among eight top titles. So it is a leading magazine. Now we move to another age. We talk with the native mobile, the millionaires. They are mobile native. They talk on mobile. They spend more than eight hours, 10 hours on mobile, on social. What kind of value we can create for them besides information? because the information they get from friends, they don't care sometimes which brands or which media is coming from the information. But how we engage them and how we create value to them and create values to advertisers as well. It's all about storytelling. It's all about content creative. So we think about future. We think about the large reaches of L as a media. We saw that we are quite covered from magazine with more than six million readership per month. On the digital platform, we reach out around 18 million unique visitors per month. We have more than eight million followers on different social medias. It is a large, rich media and brand. And we have a quite well-recognized brand equity and brand image in China. So when we think about how we can create new values, when we think about how we can bring new opportunity to our business, we think about first what they really want this new generation. Fashion for them is a dream. Fashion for them is all about style, all about the way I'm living, all about the humor, all about everything they want to share every day. To extent, uh, full extension, we developed video quite early. I think 6208, we started already, we called LTV. We create already video content, create excitement with them. So I, I, I won't show you video today because we produce annually more than 200 clips uh, in L as a title. But I, I won't show you today, it's just part to show you how we can do it on fashion images, stories, interviews, etc., etc. But today I want to talk about, besides these videos, these contents, what I call me and my friends. It's about shareable. What I read, what I receive information, what I can share with my friends. 
I'm going to talk about we, together, us, young generation, what do we want to do? In China, since two years, movie business is going up very quickly. In Shanghai, in October, only on October, we have five musical festivals going on. Young generation is looking besides information about experience. Fashion is more than information. Fashion is more than inspiration. Fashion is about experience. And that's what we are think, thinking that L we can bring and build up to them. Ooh, sorry, make a mistake on it. Excuse me. Push, I push the wrong button. Okay, thank you. So we think about what we got as identity and what we can bring to them through our identity. So we create five different type of events and what we think it is interesting to work on it. The first one is what we know the best. It's all about the icons, fashion icons, the designers. The Air Star War has been first launched in UK and we bring it to China on 208, and it come out a great event and very successful event in China. I'm going to talk about it later. And last year, on 2014, uh, we decided to go further, to go beyond it just insiders event to a public event. So we launched our fashion and the music festivals. A two days event, more than 6,000 people have participated in this event. Okay. And we also know that L is very close to celebrities. So we have another event associated with Shanghai Movie Festivals. And this is create new topics for the readers, for our advertisers to associate also our readers. A new upcoming trend quite important in China is all about sport. And I think this is everywhere. Women dress on sport wears, mix with everything, and women love to go out, do shopping, go out with kids, go to movies, everything on sport wear. So we launched a campaign called Run As L, and we start, started on 2014, and it is a good success. So I'm going to talk with, uh, about these four events. And besides these four events, there's one thing quite unique to our brand in China is that since 2008, we launched a credit card, branded credit card called uh, L Card. It's a gold card, very upscale female rich. Today we have 2.1 million card holders. And it's a shared database with the bank. So that will allow us to create a real reach, an in-depth reach with our uh, readers and also create business opportunities for our advertisers. Let's talk about our Star Wars. Our Star Wars since 2008, now we are approaching our seven years, and uh, we, for the past years, we have more than 40 sponsors inside it. And today, our sponsors consider this event as opportunity to create stories. Advertisers and our partners think that besides what is published in articles in the magazines, create an event and happening, create a momentum of stories, and enlarge reach is the most important. So accumulatively, we have a large reaches in terms of audience. Let's say on 2014, our um, reaches through uh, social media has more than uh, 100 million people reaches out. So that's a huge value we bring to advertisers. Also, it's a huge value bring to the brand as well. Okay. So our Star Wars is all about associate design and uh, fashion icons. And second, that's what I mentioned, we've launched on 2014, as this new event is associated with fashion and music. 2014, we do a two days event with a modern music group that we invite 
four rock and roll groups to sing, of course, organize, associate with eight uh, local fashion brands to do the fashion together with music. And this has attracted a lot of tensions, of course. And as I said, as I mentioned before, more than 6,000 people have participated to this event. On 2015, we are going to make this event will be a users paid event. It, it was um, free on 2014. And with this important experience, we want to make it a paid event this year by the end of the year before Christmas. And we are quite confident on this event um, creation. So we turn out our, from a print media, from a digital media, to an experience to share. And what we see as opportunity on this event is that as China's city is developing quite quickly, and this demand on this event is not only in Shanghai or in Beijing. So there's an opportunity, opportunity for us to extend the event to different cities in different scale and create new uh, business opportunities, of course. This is another event we create with Shanghai um, uh, Film Festival associated with Huayi. Huayi is one of the biggest movie makers today in China. It is also a movie distributor. They have also an agency of models and celebrities. So this is an event that we bring in yearly, every year, around 500 celebrities together. And of course, that seven uh, sponsors is, less, uh, is on 2015. Accumulated that we have more than 20 sponsors inside already. As I repeat, it's all about create another kind of content for advertisers and experience for our readers as well. So this event have high exposure during the, uh, the uh, film festival, associated with quite a lot of international uh, big names, stars, Sophie Marceau, et cetera. So um, for us, for L, as a media, it is also very important for us to, to create a linkage with the movie industry and uh, get into a new opportunities. And um, Yuan SL, as, as I mentioned, this is an event we've created to link with what is stylish fit today, what is a stylish fitness style. This allowed us to extend our uh, advertisers portfolio to sport brands and also to some of the uh, new digital products like Fitbit, etc., which is not usually our advertisers. It is also allowed us to extend us to different cities, starting from Shanghai to Chengdu to Beijing, different cities, to reach different readers and create different events and opportunities. So, um, I don't know whether you are familiar with the upcoming trends in China on the sports. That's in Shanghai, now on a monthly basis, there's a running event going on. And sport has been considered as the upcoming trends, upcoming event in China, encouraged by government, invested by government. So we see Run SL just a starting point for the brand of L to get into the fitness and stylish fitness new field. Okay, last one, and I think this one is quite um, important for us, is that we do have a precious um, credit card holders database. And when we talk about the riches and the CPMs, we know how hard to monetize on digital. That we all know that, but holding a 2.2 million critical holders database, that's precious. And that can allow us to create a lot of opportunities and encountering for our critical users and advertisers. From the launch of the, uh, the credit card, we have more than 40 events going on um, year on year. These events, including the store opening like your store opening in Shanghai, also including the uh, um, 
kind of event, weighting testing event in Chengdu. So this is a new way to create new revenue stream for us. Event is not an easy business. It requires a lot of efforts, requires a lot of creativities and partners. In L, we have a marketing of five person, supported by our corporate team, around three person on it. And these eight people, they have to create all the events year round with partnership and with partner support. But we do think that besides the engagement on content extension, all the efforts we are doing as a leading media, we need to engage more our new generations and to see how we can create values between them, advertisers, and the media. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Right, any questions? Right there, one, two, three, four, five. Off we go, start. Could you uh, talk a bit more about how the partnership with banks work? The L card payment model is there? Yeah, okay. Um, Excuse me. The, it, it is actually, we started on 208, it's quite early age, so it is um, gold card. Our duty is we promote the car. And uh, the promote duty of the promote, we, have, we do the marketing event to promote the car, to recruit new members on it, and um, it is almost free car, so we don't get any money from the bank. So all our monetization is coming from events and also the database event we're creating. Besides on-ground events, we have a lot of EDM, sales, advertisement, we go through with the uh, database. So it is, um, uh, the partnership is very simple. We promote the car, we make it continue to grow and it will provide exclusive experience to the uh, car holders. It's not a discount car. Because from the beginning, L, we have positioning. This is a gold car. It is prestigious car. So it's not a discount car. It's a car we provide experience and opportunity for, for the car holders to reach out to luxury brands and to reach out extraordinary experience. Is, is it Visa, is it MasterCard, is it a main Visa, bank? Visa, Visa and, and uh, Union Pay. So you're the media partner, you get the data? Yes. What's the percentage of your uh, uh, digital revenue uh, coming to Our uh, digital China? revenue uh, nowadays is relative, uh, still quite low. For, well, we think still quite low. It's around 12% uh, to 15%. 15%? Yeah, 15, one five. And, and this is already 10%? Yes. 10 plus 15? Yeah. Oh, that's included? No, not included. Digital okay. is digital. Uh, event okay. is event. Yeah. Okay, thank you. And how fast is events growing? year on year. It's 10% now, how much was it last year? Uh, last, year's, last year is 8%, we didn't really okay. force on the year is not closing yet, yeah. Have you changed the editorial mix in any way to reflect going into different areas like sport? Uh, so has the magazine changed in any way uh, as you've we followed these events? We, we don't change the format of our print uh, magazines. We do have the sports section, but it's very small. It's business section. It's very small. But on our apps, if you can download it from your apps, but if you go to Chinese news sense though, it's called Ed Plus. It's a video uh, and it's, it's daily updated apps content associated with the mobile site. And on that part, every week we have a new content on sports. Yeah. And that's, that, that's content is very linked to our DNA which is that actually it's a sport demonstrated by models or celebrities or stars. And, and picking up on that, how involved or how visible are your editors or your editor in, in these events? Do you put them forward as the face of the event, as the host or the keynote speaker, or are they really sort of behind the scene? The editor-in-chief, of course, is the leading person of the whole event project link it with fashion and celebrities. But for the project like Run Us L, uh, we have great runner, running team inside L editorial with three great runners. So they are the leading face of the, uh, the project. Okay. Mm. Yeah, follow. I just have a follow-up question. Sure, sure. Do you think you'll consider moving to a rev share split for the credit card? Uh, it, or is there a specific reason why a rev share split isn't being considered for the credit card? 
Pardon? A revenue share. Would you revenue consider share, yeah. revenue sharing with the No, it, it, it is from the beginning of a deal. So we didn't really push the bank to go to into the uh, revenue share. Yeah. Is there, is there a reason why it wouldn't be considered? Is it just purely because it's the start, or is it something which would be considered in the future? We do not see, we are not in a strong position to do the bargain with the bank on the revenue share. <coughs> that, that's actually the challenges. And, but us, we consider this channel, this 2.2 million uh, database can create quite an opportunity. We think it's fair trade, yeah. Uh, let, let's talk about margins for the events business because, uh, I mean, you, you, uh, you, uh, I picked them up before, uh, but you, you claim they're low and they're 30%. So you partner a lot. You have a lot of people that need to you know, come yes. in to, to help yes. you make all this happen. It's yes. phenomenal work. Yes. There's still 30%. That's that pretty when high. When I talk about 30%, it's combined with the uh, revenue, advertising revenue, which is together with the events. If we do purely event, event without incremental advertising revenue on it, then it is really very low. Uh, it is very low. Yeah. And also we have to consider all the manpower we put inside it, which is, yeah. is, is quite a huge investment as well. Uh, let's talk about that manpower. You said five people. Five people, plus Marketing three. Marketing devoted, plus three. That's it? Yeah. For all these events every year? Yes. Wow. We are in China. No, <laughs> still, <laughs> unbelievable. We work honestly. hard. You're really 24 doing. hours. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We don't else? leave, we work. <laughs> no, we enjoy life, you see. You see how the young generation love to enjoy life, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, anybody else? And finally, just quickly, of all the events, what, which, one is, which one works the best? Is it the awards night? Um, Nowadays, the World's Nights nice works best, but we have a large expectation, important expectation on the fashion and music events, uh -huh. because that's what attracts young people today. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. Lina Yang, Xie Xie. Xie Xie.